The world has warmed by about one degree Celsius due to the human influence on the climate so far. But some places, such as the Arctic, and also many land regions, have warmed much faster than other parts of the world, as you can see in this map using NASA GIS temperature data trends since 1950. In this study, I investigate whether the pattern of warming that we've seen to date is likely to continue in the future. To put it another way, are there locations where local warming is likely to accelerate as a function of global warming, i.e. following that red curve, or decelerate as a function of global warming and follow the blue curve? I also wanted to know if climate models agree on whether local warming will accelerate or decelerate, and why. What I found was that as the world warms up, warming is more likely to accelerate over mid-latitude land regions, those red areas on the map. And this is especially true in summertime. In contrast, climate models tend to agree that over some ocean locations, local warming will decelerate as a function of global warming. So overall, the pattern of warming is likely to change a bit. The climate models that tend to produce the most acceleration over land in terms of local warming tend to also be drying out in those locations. In places like the Western US, Central Europe and the Northeast of Australia, this leads to strongly divergent regional climate projections during summertime between climate models. Some models suggest warmer and wetter summers, while others, with accelerated local warming, project much hotter and drier summers. The difference between these possible future regional climates for two degrees global warming is larger than our best estimate of the difference between the climates in these locations at the one and a half and two degree global warming limits put forward under the Paris Agreement. It's clear that different climate models representation of nonlinear change are a large source of uncertainty in regional climate projections. This study proposes a framework for examining nonlinear local changes as a function of global warming. This framework could be used to better understand uncertainty in regional climate projections and constrain that uncertainty.